Hello everyone, I am Chessic44 and welcome to this Let's Play of Greedfall. Last episode, we uh, helped Siora out with preparing for the funeral for her mother. Everything is good there and she now, care now really cares for us. Everyone is friendly with us. Everyone! Well, except the congregation of merchants, but we can't really do anything about that right now. Also, we got another upgrade and another uh, level up, which allowed me to bring out... Not that. That thing. And it's gonna do a lot of armor damage. And I went and gave all of us more upgrades to our weapons and armor. Especially me. Oh, look at how fancy and well protected I am right now. Oh, this is beautiful. That said, now we need to go and get allies. Let's speak with all of the people we've spoken with. See if we can get them to help. First up, Dunkas, the High King. What brings you here on Omanawi? Ask him to join the alliance against Constantine. I came to ask for your help in stopping my cousin, Dunkas. Did you hear about the attacks of creatures led by strange guardians throughout the island? Yes, Darren sent a messenger to tell me about it. My cousin was sick, and to cure him, Katasak used the bonding ritual on him. But the power he received from it made him mad, and he started bonding himself in other places. He transformed his guardians each time, and used them to attack those he considers to be his rivals. What you're telling me is terrifying. Katasak and Devosh, Tire should never have bonded him. Your cousin is breaking the balance. He's consuming, and will only want to consume more. Indeed. Enonmiel Frichtemann warned me that Constantine was now targeting the Sanctuary at the heart of the island. I cannot fight him alone. I need allies. I intend to go and find the other factions and ask for their support. But I also need your people. Because we must all stand together to stop the threat that is weighing on the island. Your will to create an alliance between all the peoples on this island is wise and noble. And the call of Enomil Frichtemann cannot remain unanswered. We will be by your side in the battle. I am not a fighter, but Dedra will lead our warriors. Okay, and then. I would also like for you to take this weapon. I pray it will be useful in the fight that is coming. Thank you, Dunkus. Don't thank me. You manage to earn my people's trust. And you fight for a cause that affects us all. May the Earth support each of your steps. And may the volcano give you its strength. I must admit that I expected Dunkus to be more angered when he learned what Constantine had done. He's a sage among sages. Even amongst the Donegada. Enon Mil Frichtemann speaks in his ear. Hmm. I think he already knew what was happening, even before we came to see him. That confirms it. I made the right choice. Tiafredi couldn't have a better High King. Indeed. So what's this item he gave us here? Dunkas's people uh, peacemaker mace. Can't upgrade it. Can't upgrade it. Requires five strength, and it's one-handed. That's very crude, I have to say, and yet at the same time looks absolutely evil. Anyway, with that on our side, our next step... Let's go to... To Leme, see if they can... See if they'll be willing to come help us. And I'm going to change who I take with me, as you might expect. Let's take Petrus and Afra. Okay, fine. Remove, remove, Petrus, Afra. We'll take them to these two compa these two areas. See what happens. First step, the Mother Cardinal, who I do respect. Yes, yes, I know she's religious, and the religious people here can be a bit... extremist. Why is that still on display? We've been here for like a month, maybe two. Did they... 
Isn't that thing rotting or something? Why is it still there? As I was saying, I respect the Mother Cardinal a bit more than the, uh, than the scientist, than, uh, Governor Burham, just because she's more understanding of religious things and realizes where the limits should be. Burham has been blind to what has been happening. Your Eminence, I salute you. Sir de Sade, what can I do for you? Asked her to become allies against Constantine. Do you remember I thought that someone must have been responsible for the attacks you sustained? Yes, you thought that this guardian who sent us the animals couldn't have been acting alone. And I was right, sadly. You're hesitating. Are you afraid of my reaction? Indeed. As the person responsible is none other than my cousin, Constantine. Uh, does this mean that the congregation has decided to wage war on us? And thanks to which obscure alliance has your cousin been able to manipulate these creatures? Constantine oh acted alone, and he betrayed us as much as he betrayed you, believe me. As for the way he manipulated these creatures, do you remember that my cousin was sick? Absolutely. And it is said that his recovery was the result of a rather suspicious miracle. Are you telling me that your cousin has made a pact with the demons of this island? Something like that. He was cured by a Donegad of the island who performed a bonding ritual. But the power he received from this made him thirsty for more, and he bonded himself to other places, thus gaining control over the guardians who were protecting these sacred places. But why attack us? Did his madness make him forget about our alliance? I wonder the same. His thirst for power is making him want to control the island entirely by himself. And I know that for this purpose he will soon attack the natives' main sanctuary on the volcano. I won't stand a chance against all the creatures he's taken control of. And I need some help. Others have already joined me. But we also need the support of Teleme. Having a common enemy should help us forget all the differences that have been opposing us. The idea that we would protect the Sanctuary from an insular demon is completely insane. But you have helped us several times, and I trust your judgment. You can count on our help. My men will fight by your side. Thank you, Your Eminence. Mm. Thanks to your wisdom, we have a chance to prevail. I must leave you. Naturally, Your Excellency. All right. Good. See, it pays to do side quests and help your <coughs> your allies and partners and even random people. You never know when it could end up going well. Well, we have help from well with help from Teleme. Now we need to go to the Bridge Alliance. Again, I'm not too keen on Governor Burham, but surely he would be willing to assist. In the name of science, if nothing else. I don't know how the name of science would be applicable in this situation, but one can certainly help. I mean, it's something to try. <clears throat> Onwards to Burren. Yes, yes, camp in the woods. I don't care right now. Excellency, I'm very sorry, but I can't let you in. For safety reasons, people from Teleme are not tolerated at the palace. Do you understand? Yes, of course. I'm so dangerous that I could attack the palace all by myself. Ah. Okay. Understandable. <laughs> uh, Petrus, I'm sorry. I guess you'll just have to stay inside. I'll go in with Afra and, uh, and Kurt. Let's see, 
compose the team. Petrus, no, remove Petrus, and Kurt, come with me. Surely this is fair. I didn't know there was a thing that could happen. Good to know. I mean, they are kind of hostile to each other, but it should be noted that Afro was allowed into the Mother Cardinal's palace. So... More reason to not be too keen on the on Governor Burren. Hopefully he's going to be willing to assist. Your Excellency, Lord Desade, and to what do I owe this honor? We shall speak we are ask him to join the Alliance. I have come to solicit your help and to propose we forge an alliance. An alliance? Against whom? You remember, no doubt, the attacks that fell upon Hakemet but also San Mateus, and against the natives. Of course. You told me that different Guardians sent the beasts. Precisely. And the Guardians were manipulated by someone. I discovered who it was. This revelation will not please you, but I have no choice but to tell you. It is Constantine. Surely you jest. What is the meaning of this? Do you know how many men have oh, died God during these damn attacks? It. <sighs> Allow me to continue, I beg you. Sorry. My cousin's sickness shook him to the core. Then there was a ritual and his capture. And Constantine has fallen into madness. He has been increasing these rituals in order to link himself to the island, to gain power and manipulate its creatures. He is fighting a war against everyone. And it now appears he wants to take control of Tirfredi. He is preparing to attack the Volcano Sanctuary, and I need help to stop him. It is in the name of the Congregation that I come to see you. Constantine betrayed us as well. That's madness. It is complete madness. All of this superstitious nonsense. These absurd theories. I believed you sincere, Desade. Which does not mean that I believe you now. But no matter. You are in need of men to stop your cousin who has already attacked us. Precisely. I have already gathered support, but I need as many allies as possible. Let us be clear. I don't believe for an instant that this story has a link to the island or whatever foolishness. But I do trust you. You have rendered us valuable services and have supported us. And since we cannot allow the crimes of your cousin to go unpunished, we will stand beside you. Thank you, Excellency. Thank you. You have improved our chances of success tenfold. I have to go. Look forward to seeing you again. Farewell, my lord. I apologize for the uh, phone ringing a moment there. Someone was trying to contact me. Something relating to work, I think. I'll speak to them in a little bit. Anyway, uh... I missed part of that, but yeah, it seems like the Bridge Alliance is willing to help us. Even though they, they don't seem to believe in the whole magic part of everything that comes from believing in science. That said, with that taken care of, now we need to go back and get help from both the Knots and the Coin Guard. And you can guess who I'm going to bring with me for those. Kurt, who I've taken with me a fair number of times, and uh, Vasco, who we haven't actually taken with us very often. Remove Athra, take Vasco, and do the travel down to here, to the De Sardea residence. And in here we go. are going to be. That's going to be an easy one to get to. Thank you for moving. Yeah, the knots are down there, and the coin guard's up there. Where is the other location we're supposed to go to? Oh, all the way over there. Interesting. 
Let's go down to the coin to the knots first. They're nearby. Come closer, good people. No, thank you. I don't care to. Mainly, I'm trying to keep my eye out for uh, bullets because I'm kind of mm, low, running low a bit, running a bit low. Yeah. All right, Admiral. Desarde, what can I do for you? Ask her to join the alliance. I have come to ask for your help, Admiral. My cousin has been plunged into madness, and he apparently wishes to conquer the whole island. He took control of many creatures by reenacting rituals he learned from the islanders. And now he uses them to attack the cities and the villages of those he considers to be his rivals. A difficult situation, admittedly, but one that does not concern us. Who's in charge of the island is none of our business, Desarde, and you know that. It actually does concern you. If my cousin takes control of the island, soon there will be no ports where your ships can berth. He's not looking for political influence. He desires power. Absolute power. I see. It's a decent argument. So what now? We must stop him at all costs. And for that, I will need allies. I already have the support of other factions, but I was hoping I could count on the help of the Norts. You can. My men aren't really used to fighting on land, but they will be by your side. You have proven time and time again that we can trust you. Thank you, Admiral. May the winds be in your favor, Desarde. You'll need all the help you can get. Clearly. Thank you very much. Now to the coin guard. After that, we'll see if we can find anything out at this hidden location. Come closer, good people. No need, no need. Oh, it's you on old Malawi. Come and see. I have no need, thank you. All right, into here. You need to go upstairs. Really? Who is upstairs? Ah, right! Sieglinde. Hello, Commander. Lord Desade. How can I be of service to you? Uh, let's see. Suggest joining the Alliance. I have come to ask for your help. I'm at your service, Your Excellency. What is it you want from me? We need reinforcements to protect the sanctuary of the islanders, north of the island. Very well. I will send some troops there. But may I ask who or what they will be fighting? That was easy. Creatures in great numbers. And probably my cousin. I beg your pardon? As your men must have told you, he has changed a lot recently. Ever since he was cured of the Malachor and bonded to the island, he has become obsessed with power. He is now targeting the heart of the island. If he succeeds, we're all doomed. I have indeed heard reports of the governor's peculiar behavior. Since he is our employer, I asked my men to turn a blind eye. But thanks to your help, we avoided dishonor. I won't forget it. If you're telling me that we are in danger and that we need to go to this sanctuary, we'll go. Thank you, Commander. Anything else? There is nothing else. Thank you. I have to go. Goodbye. I also have a lot to do. Until next time, Your Excellency. All right. Everything's good there. We'll have to inform Glendon of the battle, but first, since we're all since we're here, let's see what we can find at Constantine's hideout. Hopefully we'll learn of more, more of his plans and how to prepare. Been doing a little bit of running to get there, but get there we will. Oh, it's actually on the map. <laughs> I 
We have about 10 minutes. I think we can spare the time to check. And I see hostile creatures. Oh, he has defenses! No, no, those are the basic creatures. They're not the corrupted ones. I just want to see this. Uh, I feel like it's a bit slower. Okay. So I think we need to go up this way. Put that away, please. way? Yeah, I think so. Bandits. The cave that Constantine indicated in his note shouldn't be very far. Let's be careful. You probably put some guards at the entrance. I wanted to crouch. I think I'm gonna need to go around. I don't think there's any way by. Despite apparently having the sneaky option, there really is no choice. So slow using that big two handed weapon. I think I found it. Search Constantine's secret hideout. Let's see what we can find. Oh, we've got an. We've got evil creatures. And let's go! Move away! Then you're about to get nice! Get rid of the armor, boys! Ow! Yeah, I can see that! Move away! Things are about to get nice! Okay. I actually feel a lot less effective with this thing right now. Okay. Let's see if we can find anything in here. Oof. That doesn't look very good. Not in the slightest. According to my calculations, by performing linking rituals in Credgwen and Vedvildi, Enon Milfrictimen should be sufficiently weakened, and I sufficiently powerful to fight him. I cannot wait to annihilate this senile old god. Vedvildi. 
Constantine has marked several places on this map. I recognize some of them. They are sacred places for the natives. Places of connection. This place. This journal. My poor Constantine, you have completely lost your mind. What are you hoping to achieve with these rituals? If you want my opinion, once he had a taste of the power of the Donegada, he decided he wanted more. The natives uphold a certain balance. For everything they receive, they give back to the island. Your cousin doesn't. So much so that he's threatening Enon Mil Frictaman himself. He wants to take his place. To think he's been plotting this absurd plan for weeks. He even used us to achieve it. The intruder in the sanctuary was certainly sent by him to scout the place. We'll need to gather allies if we're going to stop him. But we will also have to weaken him and break apart the bonds that he's established. I don't know exactly how these things work. And unless you do, we're gonna need help. How about Dunkus? Mev scares me a little. You're right. Let's go and find him. Okay. Ask Dunkas for his help in weakening it, our cousin. Something I think we'll be able to do. I'll keep Kurt with me, but we'll take Siora back with us. We'll speak over there, see what we can do. But that is going to have to be in the next episode, because this one has gone on just about long enough, I think. I think there's a path up here that I can take to some chest that I didn't grab before. Once I see what's in there, I'm going to have to end the episode, because it's gone on about long. Yes, this <laughs> jump! Oh! Wait, isn't this... No, we wouldn't have been able to climb up. Okay, so, I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. Next episode, we'll go to Dunca Dunkas and see what we can do to weaken our cousin and make things, and prepare things better for what is to come. That'll be in the next episode. So until then, I'm Chester44. That is Desarde, Vasco, and Kurt. This has been a Let's Play of Greedfall. And I shall see you all next time.